Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of the Minecraft vlog. Do you notice anything different? I don't know. Do you? How about now? You still don't notice it? Yeah, sure. Yeah, that's right. We got off the fine. <laughs> Finally. I've been uh, waiting for this to come out for a while, and I think it did come out, like, maybe a week ago, but I couldn't find it. Uh, but I did eventually get it. And here we are now. We have the zoom feature. Oh, so nice. It'll be so nice for making videos. And then we also have the smooth glass, which is something that, oh my goodness, it is just so freaking nice to have. I really, really love this feature. Um, but let me show you what I've been doing in between uh, the episode. So I have dug out a little bit more. We got this nice little area here. And what I was thinking is we would put some sort of elevator in here to get up to the top because right now the only way in and out of this base is via elytra so we're gonna need to fix that and we'll probably do that this episode and then also i finished this hallway oh stay back i do not want to get blown up okay we're good so yeah i finished this hallway right here i think it's looking pretty nice and then we, of course, have the bamboo farm from last episode. And actually, I should probably clean up that area so it doesn't look so nasty when it's just flown back and forth. Um, and I did actually finish the bamboo farm. So down here, we have um, a daylight sensor hooked up to a uh, monostable circuit. So it just pulses it, sends the minecart off, sends the flying machine off, and we get loads and loads of bamboo, which... Wow, we have a ton. And then, right now, I'm just manually putting it in here. Although, did it seriously just burn through a whole entire stack? How much bamboo do you need for one item? One. Oh my. Holy. Wow, people. That's crazy. We needed five bamboo per item? Shoot. <laughs> Oh, whoa, whoa, that was a little close for comfort. We're going to need more bamboo? Oh my gosh. I hadn't realized how bad that was. I thought I was just like, yeah, I'll just pop a couple bamboo in here every so often, and then I should be good. But nope, it looks like we're going to have to do it automatically. And that should be a little tricky, because you see this line of redstone right here? This is actually, uh, this block is actually being powered. So if I put a hopper right here... Um, the bamboo can't flow into it, so that's been an issue. I'm gonna have to set up some my uh, some logic systems so that when um, there are no items running through this system, we can actually load up those hoppers. But oh, that's gonna be a little bit tricky. Um, I think you know what? Let, let let's do that. Let's do that. The first part of this episode. Let me get some stuff put together, and then I'll be right back. Oh, you so thought I was going to start a time lapse right there. Gotcha. Editing so great. Whew, it's been a while since the last of guys. I've done quite a bit of work behind this door. Oh my goodness. Thunder, holy cow, that was loud. Okay, as I was saying, I've done... You know what, Thunder, just... <clears throat> we'll turn you down a little bit. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> What I was saying, though, is I've done a lot of work. I kind of got carried away. Um, and basically, I just prettied up all the redstone, added a few more things, and it looks kind of crazy now. I'm actually really happy with how this turned out. Bear with me for a moment while I do some explaining. I'm kind of all over the place. Glass, especially. I think it just looks so good where you can see the redstone. But let me see if I can walk you through... Uh, what's going on here? So we have another entrance over here, and this is from the oh get out How did you get how did you get in there? And why is there an iron bar missing? Uh, that's the problem for another day. Yeah, we have this entrance right here into the redstone and The furnaces are just beneath these hoppers here, and this is the uh, original super smelter thing, but what I did add is a little bit of logic. So, this comparator right here, it's detecting this chest. So whenever 
um, items are sent into the system. It'll travel down this line, down here, through here, run up the Redstone Torch Tower, and it will turn on this thing, which is not what we want. Wait. No, 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 no. It is what we want. Okay, yeah. I'm just confused myself. So we'll turn on this thing, which activates the super smelter there, right? So we have that part. And then down here, I added a daylight sensor. And this, whenever it turns day, it'll send a quick pulse to here, which runs down this line through here, up this torch tower, and it will power our minecart right here. But it will power the minecart. The minecart will send itself down over here, go across the bridge, down, and start collecting all of the stuff. And then once it bounces back, it'll head back up over the two arches and rest right here. But, um, you know that signal that I said powered the minecart that sent it down there? Well, it also powers this little doodad here. And this is, I think it's called an etho hopper clock. And basically, when it gets powered, it will send a timer long enough that when the minecart arrives back here, it'll unload some of its stuff. And then this will activate again and it'll get sent off. So it's just making it get sent like twice because one hopper minecart isn't enough to pick up all of the bamboo. Because, I mean, oh, I wanted to open that chest. Yeah, because we have a lot of bamboo. Um, so we have that, and I think those are the two bits of redstone that I added. I think that's it. And then I just kind of prettied everything up, put like the redstone wiring on display. We have all of this stuff. We have the, the mine cards going in weird patterns. And then back here, I have the other side in case we ever need to come back here and like uh, do some maintenance or work on it. Then we have over here just some more display of the redstone. We can come back here, fix stuff if we ever need to, if it gets clogged. And wow, ow, wow. Do we seriously? We need more coal. <sighs> yeah, I didn't I didn't really hook up this side with bamboo because, I don't know. I just thought the coal would last longer, guys. <sighs> uh, but as I was saying, uh, we have some more stuff over here. We have some chests. Always have crafting tables nearby. Like, you need these suckers everywhere. And then we have up here just another little area. This is kind of just for looks over here. And then just more access from up above. And yeah, I think it turned out really, really well. Uh, let me know if you think it turned out well. It could just look like a giant mess. But I, I quite like it, so it's staying. And we can actually move on with the episode. But also, we should probably give it a test, right? So, you know what, let's just smelt some of this. And, do the first messes turn on? What are we thinking, guys? What are we thinking? I'm thinking that it broke. Yep. <laughs> Why you no work? Let's just try deleting that block. Does it work now? Oh, I think I fixed it. Yeah, hopefully. Destroying that one block. Was that the problem? Um... Yes, I think it was. So if we remove this, yeah, we can start seeing the stone come in. That is exactly what we want. Now we actually need to um, get some bamboo in the system. So let's see. Let's just grab some of you and load it in this hopper. And then it should begin to distribute. Although one flaw with this is it doesn't distribute it evenly. It's just going to have to back up a lot. So that means... We have to fill up, um, here, let me see if I can show you. So that means we have to fill up this furnace. We have to fill up this hopper, this hopper. Oh, whoa, let's grab some of that. <laughs> fill up this hopper, fill up this hopper, and then it'll start moving along to the next stuff. So we're going to need a lot of bamboo. But that's why we have this epic farm right here. And by the way, we still have a manual button, so let's just... Oh, yeah. I still love this thing. It's so awesome. <laughs> Amazing. I was planning on doing something with music discs today, actually. Because, you know, I don't really ever mess with those. And I thought it'd be kind of fun. Oh, 
no, 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 no. What I was about to say before I was rudely interrupted by that creeper is we need to gather some supplies. So let me go do that real quick and there's another one. We're going to need some diamonds. Let's grab two of those. Some wood, some redstone, and jukeboxes. I need some leather, but um, there's one cow. That's a problem. We found some guys, yes! <gasps> that took so much longer than I expected. Uh, let's see. We're just gonna do a little little trade here. I'll give, him, I'll give him payment, don't you worry guys. We'll just say needed a little leather. There's an A in there. There we go. Yeah, I, th I think that's good. Fair trade, like four pieces of the leather. For two diamonds. I think that's a good trade. I'd do that any day, right? Whoa, that's a little close. I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of addicted to this zoom feature. <sighs> okay, let's let's head back though. We got the leather we needed. We have our two jukeboxes right here, but we're gonna need some music discs to go in them, and that's gonna be a bit of a problem. So I don't know if the mob farm would have any. I I really, really doubt it, because, I mean, like, how would there be any, right? Like, because you gotta have a skeleton shoot a creeper. But we might as well give it a check. So all these should be sorted. What about you? Yeah, no music discs. So we are? Wow, we're getting quite the flow of mobs in. Okay, and I already checked my starter base, so... That means we're gonna have to, uh, actually see if we can get a skeleton to shoot a creeper. So let's go a little ways away, and I think we'll try and trap a creeper. I've never tried trapping a creeper. Hopefully it works all right. And then we'll have to lure a skeleton in. So I believe, yeah, this is a nice plains biome. Hopefully it'll work. Yeah, I was saying my plan is actually like one of the simplest mob farms ever. Um... If you guys have ever watched, like, Ethos Lab, like, that's who I first started watching into YouTube, actually. And he made this in his very first episode ever. So hopefully it works. So we're just going to need um, a trap door and four doors. So let's grab you. We got six, so that's good. And, oh, shoot, let's build it. Quick, quick, quick. Oh! No, 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 I did it wrong, I did it wrong. <laughs> so, will you shut now? Yep, that's good, that's good. And, yes, that is exactly what we want. Now, let's find a creeper. Creeper, where you at? You, yeah, you, creeper, come over here. I need your music disc. The one that's hidden inside you. Yeah, like, honestly, why do you think music discs drop from creepers? Is it, like their brain or something but I, I don't know maybe teen t is their brain okay come on over here yep you see me you see me come straight through nope why don't you want to walk there okay um nope okay we're gonna try something a little dangerous okay creeper you know work with me work with me work with me can they not go through doors is that what i've discovered Oh no! Why is this so difficult? They really don't like doors. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna have to do this the old fashioned way. Okay, he's lit. Um, don't die, please. Skeleton? Hey, see me? Hey, you! Yeah, you! You with the face of bones! Okay, that's perfect. Now, come on, shoot him, shoot him! Shoot him! Come on! No, so close! Come on, come on. You're so close. Come on. No! Okay, maybe he needs to be angled up. No, what lag? Okay. No! Oh, I 
and he's gone. Okay, take two. Um, yeah, you. You look like you want to be turned into a music disc. So that one was a bit of a fail. No! And that one. No! No! And that one. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're taking off. We're taking flight. Okay. Whew, that was a little close for comfort. <laughs> oh, how am I going to do this? Do I need to trap a skeleton? Maybe? Yeah, you. Yeah, that was a fail too. Come on. Yes! Okay, we got one! We got one! Don't blow up! Okay. Whew, that was a little difficult. Uh. Okay. Ouch. Okay, let's see if we can get another. No. 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 I need more time. What did we get? Blocks. I think that's a good one. Actually, let's try it out. Actually, no, no, no. No. That's a bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. Um, we need a creeper. Creeper. Come here. No. Please don't blow up. Okay. You! No! Uh, I'm so bad at this! <laughs> okay. We got one creeper primed. Um, skeleton. Where's the skeleton? We need a skeleton. You. Yes. Come here. Come here, you. Yes. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't blow up. Don't blow up. No. Okay. Another creeper. Come here. Okay. Um, skeleton is in a hole. Okay. Come here. Yep. Yep. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. No. Baby. No. Stay back. Stay back. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. So close. Yes. Okay. We got another. Uh. Die. Okay. Whew. We got two. Um. Oh. That's a cool word. I don't really know how to pronounce it. Me Meloni? I don't know. Pronounce it how you want. Oh. Shoot. Can we get one more? One more. Are we quick enough? Come on. Come here, creeper. Come here. No, I don't know if we're going to be quick enough. Yes, come here. Come here. I don't know if we're going to be able to do it. No, don't run away from me. Baby zombie. Okay, yes. Yep, uh-huh. We got one. Okay. No, no, no. He has a flame bow. Skeleton. Yes, come on. Lined up. Yes, we got one. Okay, one more. Come on. No, he hit him. Oh, one. Yep, of course. Oh, wow. My health is actually really low. Any more creepers? Okay, guys. I think I think that's good for one night. Where did the, the, the disc go? Okay. Whew. Uh, let's go home. <laughs> I got so many arrows in me. Oh, okay. We're we're gone. We're gone. We're gone. So after a hard night work, we got three music discs, and uh, they're all different. So that's great. We have blocks. Uh, Mel Meloni? Mel O I. Mel I? Mel I? I don't know. Whatever you want to call it. And Ward. So that is pretty cool. Now I think we're just gonna throw the jukebox station thingy right here ish. I think this is a fairly good spot. So let me get some stuff together and I'll show you what I come up with. You know. I hope this doesn't bug me. <laughs> These two are not lined up properly. Uh, that's a little bit annoying, but I think I can live with it. In fact, you know what? We could just like make the tunnel get bigger as we go into the mountain, and then it match up. So that's an option, I guess. Uh, yeah, we'll probably just do that. But yeah, sorry, that was that was completely sidetracked. Let's get back with this. Okay, guys, I totally forgot to record this part, so enjoy some Parker commentary. Okay, so Nathan just asked me to come over here, and he's struggling a little bit to get in. Oh, can he do it? I mean, to be fair, it is pretty hard. Let's see if he can, though. Oh, there he goes. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Oh, and first try. That's how we do it, guys. That's how we do it. Uh, I heard that creepers don't like your wood. Nathan, uh, that's true. <laughs> Thanks, Nathan. 
I can promise I can spell man. Yeah, I forgot to check this area, so. Holy! Oh my gosh! Nathan! Dude! That's insane! Holy cow! <laughs> Holy! Wow. <laughs> Thanks so much. Oh my goodness, guys. This is crazy. Look at all this wood. And the axe. Oh my gosh. This is great. Yeah. Oh, sticky keys. I was shifting too hard. Holy cow. <laughs> Dude, that is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, let's snag this. Okay, and looks like he wants to show us something else. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, this one. Oh, Nathan was here. Okay. And what's in the room? Oh my goodness. Isaac forgot these, Nathan. <gasps> oh my gosh, guys. Thanks so much. <laughs> Keep the presents rolling. No, just kidding. Like, this is already a ton of stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is actually crazy. Man. <laughs> and this one. Oh, yes, I did get the sword. So, thanks a lot for the sword, too. Like, that was a nice sword, I gotta say. Yeah, for sure. Love the name, yeah, dude. If you guys didn't see the past video, go check it out. It's pretty hilarious. <laughs> and guys, I should have started doing YouTube earlier. We're getting so many presents. This is actually insane. <laughs> oh, man. But if you guys didn't see that video, make sure to go check it. It's a pretty good one. <laughs> uh, well, bye, Nathan. And thank you so much. Like, this is actually insane, guys. Presents are amazing. I just gotta say that. And Sneaky Creeper, taken care of. And we gotta make sure to not forget our present because we don't wanna miss this. Like, look at that, it's amazing. Thank you so much, guys. Presents aside, I've actually got some pretty good work done here. And as you can see, we have our jukebox and even a note block. So, I don't know, you can probably do something pretty cool with that, I don't know. I, I, I'm not super great with that. I had to look up a tutorial for that bed thing. Um, but you might have been wondering why we were getting that leather, and that is for item frames. I'm just going to check them right here so we can actually house our music discs right here. And you know what? Let's let's try one. Is this... Okay, it's blocks. What does it sound like? Okay. I don't know how much I like that one. Let's try... You. Oh, that's a little, little bit creepy, but all right. It's like a funeral march or something. And the last one. Okay, this is like a, a detective song, you know? Solving some crime, you know? <laughs> kind of funny. But, uh, yeah, I think this turned out pretty good. And we have this one over here as well. And we're going to need some more leather. I don't know how we're going to do that. Maybe we'll go uh, trade some more. Like, two diamonds for four more or something like that. Um, but, yeah, I think this is turning out pretty nice. And... That is actually it for today, guys. I'm running out of time. So I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. And if you find yourself at the end of this video, I just want to say thank you again. Like, this is crazy. Today, my view time actually doubled. So that is pretty crazy. And as all YouTubers would say, I guess, if you really enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like or even consider subscribing. Uh, but that's it for me today. My name is Parker, and I will see you in the next video.